In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily whitewash your brick walls with simple tools you can use. For those who doesn't have a brick wall and are in the process of choosing a brick veneer, I would like to quickly explain the different types you can find on the market. The first type I would like to show you is clay Chicago brick veneers. These brick veneers were sawn cut with wet saws and uh, very rustic textures. And uh, you can whitewash these as well, but I would recommend using the cheaper version of manufactured tin brick veneers. Second type is manufactured tin brick veneers. These brick veneers come in wide array of colors and we can make custom colors as well you can whitewash this in a simple way just as any clay brick veneers to whitewash your brick walls you will need a bucket a large fluffy paint roller a paint tray hydrated lime powder white cement and water the first step in whitewashing your brick wall is mixing your whitewash fill your bucket with water about halfway. Add your hydrated lime to the water. You will have to gauge the amount depending on how thick you wish to whitewash your brick wall. The less hydrated lime you add, the more you will see the colors of the bricks. I would recommend adding the same amount of white Portland cement to the mix. This will bond your mixture to a solid state in a short time. Whitewash looks a lot lighter when it's still wet. It will dry to a lot wider state when it is dry. It is a good idea to do a test area to see how it looks when the whitewash dried. Use a fan to blow some air if you have one. It will speed up your drying time. After you applied your whitewash, there is only one thing to do besides waiting for it to dry. You can grab a slightly wet sponge and remove some of the whitewash off of some of the bricks. If you are whitewashing your newly installed brick veneers, you should always apply it before grouting. This way the grout will not be whitewashed. It will give a more intentional and even finish. If your brick wall is grouted, you will have to whitewash everything. Which is not a problem, it is a nice style to do. So for new installation, after the lime washing, you will have to do the grouting. I do not want to go into the details too much. We use S-type mortar mix, we mix it to a soupy consistency and squeeze it into the joints. After we shape the mortar with the concave jointer, wait a few minutes and brush the excess mortar off the wall. If you wish to learn more about the installation and grouting process, please see our how to install brick veneer video. I will put a link in the description. So to conclude, you can easily create a whitewashed brick wall that will be the focal point of your room. You can do it on interior brick walls, exterior brick walls, arched brick walls, rustic brick walls, fireplaces, in living rooms, restaurants, or even in hair salons. The possibilities are endless. Let your creativity soar. If you wish to have a unique whitewashed brick wall without the messy whitewashing process, you can call us. We manufactured pre-whitewashed brick veneers in any color mixes and you specify the amount of whitewash you prefer. Call us for your free samples.